What's going on, y'all? This is Nate from Nate and Your State back at you at a, with another video. It is another day. This probably might be a continuation of the previous day as I haven't had much time to record. And because it was raining for the majority of the morning, I'm finally out here around noon time this uh, Saturday, noon time, on the beach of Costa Rica here in Limon. But I would have to say, I think this area that I'm at isn't well kept. It's a, it's a bit unkempt. And there's a lot of interesting stuff that you'll see over here, regardless the fact of how the beach looks, right? Like you'll see like your bottles and stuff here and a little bit of trash around the beach. You know what I'm saying? It's a little unappetizing. You know, you got stuff over there-ish and all that stuff, you know? However, I see something quite interesting. We have a little shipwreck over here, and I would love to know the story about this boat that's just here on shore, you know? Hey, man, if a boat can tell a story, bro. Nate, in your state. Bro, Tokyo, I'm actually staying in this area. I don't know if it's safe or not. They said it's chill. Oh, look, I think that's dope. Yeah, they said it's chill, so, um, Hopefully I'll be alright. You know, there's nothing that I can't really much pretty much I can't handle. But we'll see. It looks nice. Yeah, we'll we'll figure it out. It looks nice. But we'll figure it out as time goes on, alright? Yeah. Got you guys. Got you guys. So far it looks nice. Beach is empty. Well, there's people on the beach. Never mind. I could possibly fly the drone there. Or I can go to, what is it, Playa Bonita and fly the drone there. Still figuring it out as we go. So it's K9 Municipality Park. Parque Canino Municipality. But they said no dogs and all that crap. No smoke. They didn't say no drones though. Yeah. Um, it's warm as heck here, man. Sheesh, man. Is what it is, man. It is what it is. This is what I could get. Because the other place had to cancel because it had a leak. So Nate is here. It's the quickest thing I can find that's close to the bus station. I didn't want to go too deep. Just in case I need to do an emergency evac. Yeah. Alright, I gotta check my maps again, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cut it here. Yo. These guys chicken is like really free roaming. Can I see that? Fire. Non cage chickens, bro. Yo, let me show y'all something. Look how big the grasshoppers hill. You see that? Look how big them dudes are, fam. And look at them just chilling. Solid, bro. And we just you mean to tell me I'm from all of this? I can just walk and I'm straight here? Like, for real, for real? Yeah, I'm staying nearby. Man. Just heads up, but yeah, you mean from all of this? I'm right here? For real, for real? Oh, solid. Solid. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a walk. Is that a shipwreck? I think that is a shipwreck. Wow. Who oh, no. It's a little walk. Just pull up. You are right here. <laughs> Costa Rica. Solid. Lamone, Costa Rica, man. I think I'm gonna have fun here. If you're new to the channel, please consider dropping a like, or subscribing, dropping a like, and then, you know, engage in the comments. Let me know how you feel. Um, what do you think about Costa Rica or my other videos? And feel free to check out my other videos if you haven't done so. And let me know what you think. What's your thought process, you know? And if there's anything else you'd like me, you would like me to go or what you would like to see, just keep me informed. So now let's get back to this video. All right. Cool. Um, yeah, man, this 
beach has seen better days. And I just know it will be like such a beautiful thing. Like if, you know, if all the trash was like removed or whatever have you. Because I am I doubt the water is bad, you know. Have, have yet to just jump into it. But you see stuff like this over here. I'm like, dang, man, why would they do that? You know, why would they, uh, you know, trash like that? Bottles and stuff, man. It reminds me of Orchard Beach in the Bronx. Bronx, New York. With all the trash around. That's why I never really went to Orchard Beach. Because you got stuff like that over here. I'm like, come on now. But, uh, wildlife lives here. You see a lot of uh, crab holes. You know, you see that. Well, I stepped on one. Excuse me. Sorry, Mother Nature. But you'll see a lot of them over here. Right? And if I can catch one, I'll show you the crabs. The sand crabs. But, yeah, you see you see stuff like that. Like that. You know, and especially this. Like, come on now. This makes this beach feel very hood. You know what I'm saying? Like a whole toilet system, fam. That's a washing machine, I think. So that's what I'm saying. Like, if this beach can tell, like, a whole story, man, I wonder what it'll say. But across the yonder, man, you can see the port, the Perry, Pierre, I think it's called. I say Perry. Perry or Pierre. Let me know in the comments. Is it Pierre or Perry? I always call it a pier, pier, pier. You can see the uh, pier ports further down there. We'll see if I can make my way over there. Just that the other days, this was raining like crazy. Yeah, a little bit. I'm not sure if this is sewage and all that. It leads into the, the beach. So I'm not sure. He might be homeless, but I think he's going to go take a bath. You know? Because I see like a tent and stuff over there. Yeah. But there is a little sort of remote village style thing over here in the corner. If you keep walking towards the M. It looks pretty nice. I can't front. Let's see as much as I can get while, you know, the cloud is still poking through this cloudy day. And I'm already sweating. Sheesh. You see the boats? Yeah, man. I wonder, I wonder what Lamon could tell me if it had a voice to speak. Mm. I don't think it's a... I mean, if you're looking at this side of the beach from here to the end... I don't think it's that bad to like uh, get a cleanup crew and like rake all this up. I don't think it'll be that bad. Maybe those that are from Limon or Costa Rican historians can let me know um, in the comments uh, what happened over here in Limon and how did uh, things end up the way they are at this region. But granted, I know there's someone that's going to correct me that I am in a different body, oh yes. Um, but this is still Limon as a whole. You know, they, they say that Puerto Ve uh, Viejo is still Limon too, even though it's by the border of Panama. That is still Limon. So, hey, if you guys can let me know what's up, you know, I'd, I'd happily love to receive that information. Or whatever information I could find doing some internet research. Because once again, your boy is here without any solid knowledge but if i find something i'm going to do a voiceover and to drop it in there and then everybody else can tag in with their two cents get what i'm saying get what i'm saying like these little creeks of water not sure if it's sewage or something that's why i'm kind of afraid to jump in the water because i'm like it's coming from somewhere i knew it rained i know it rained but you know with all that junk in between it makes me think that uh, i don't know if i want to jump in that water but i'm not too quite too sure but knowing me i'm probably going to jump in it anyway if it's not this side it's probably going to be the other side find my way over playa bonita you know if i, if I can make it happen man mm. hey if i can even walk to playa bonita now we'll see we'll see we'll see how much strength i have today as it is a little a bit humid very humid wait i've just passed something very important let me show you guys. You see? Hey, that is a crab hole, and you see a crab pincer. I'm telling you, these things are related. 
if you didn't know that already. But yeah, you can do fishing in this water. So I have seen a lot of fishermen around this area like yesterday. So I'm most likely gonna cut this video until I see something else. But the next time I should be going back on to this video is when I am in, you know, El Central. I think it's the central of um, the Moan, right? So once I'm downtown El Central, then you'll see me doing some street recording. Then I'll give my live commentary. Well, it's not live, but I'll give my commentary as I go. Yeah, man. Before I even jump in, <laughs> this is one of the reports before the, I got the people who want to go fish, you know, because the sea is over there. But yeah, that's a piece of it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I know earlier I just passed by where I'm staying. They have like this outreach center where they uh, give out free to those that are in need. I didn't think it was appropriate for me to record homeless people um, getting, I don't know, I don't know, let me know if I'm wrong for not recording community uh, community handouts, but you know, just letting you know that they do that over here for those that are in need. Um, another thing that I want to show y'all, look, I thought that's cool. <laughs> this looked like a little village, that's why, that's why I, like, I like this little section. You know, you got the houses over here and people's out there going to fish. You know what I'm saying? On this little bridge, you know what I'm saying? Going towards my area, but yeah, over there and around the corner, they're doing, they're giving food to people, right? This is one of the guys that got, you know, a plate of food and drink. You know, and I, th I thought that was pretty cool for those that, you know, can't afford it. They got that over here. Um, yeah, I don't got no, I don't got that YouTube money to do any donations yet. But in the future, you know, if I come back here, man, I'm gonna help out these guys. Directly up north from the the bus terminal directly up is just i think it's the main central this is what downtown whatever have you people out and about very interesting dynamics that they got here no stoplight no stop sign but yet people seem to make it work he's not taking the risk i would have took the risk if i was him but once again it ain't even my my backyard it looks pretty crowded over there i would like to check that out but I'm just looking for food or something. Food or something feasible at the moment. Oh, they look attractive. Sheesh. Okay. Fucking got some food here. I don't even know. What, what could I even sell? I don't even know. What could I even sell? It's a no name, no name restaurant. And I don't even know what they got inside. Um, we will continue to find out as we keep going. I'm already lost, y'all. As we are here in Nathan Hill State, trying to figure stuff out while we're here. You know? Downtown look pretty solid, though. Can't even hold you. This is a little bit. Show you guys a little bit before I turn back around. Because I want something authentic to eat. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there's an Entertel here. I can just keep going up and figure it out. And I think I'll hit Jamaica Town if I keep going up, right? I should. Or even, I might be even in the area myself. This could be Jamaica Town. Let's see. Let me check my... Well, apparently I'm nowhere near Jamaica town, but I'm somewhere. Um, yeah, let me try the KFC. I've been trying, I've been wanting to try a Costa Rican KFC for a minute. You feel me? All right, there goes their clock tower. Clock tower is just the center square. Yeah, let's go, let's go get some chicken. Forget it. Because KFC in Jamaica is king. And I am in the Costa Rican neighborhood known to have a lot of Jamaicans. Now, I can't say for sure if the Jamaican food, the Jamaican KFC is going to translate into this, but we'll find out anyway. I highly doubt it, but it is what it is. So here we have the big box wings and their barbecue chicken, right? It comes with popcorn chicken. Okay, solid. And I can thigh. Rice and the biscuit. It's 
spicy sauce, ketchup. Yeah, they like they like ketchup and mayonnaise over there. I, I, I can't count on why, but they do in wings, all right? So here we go. It's neither bad nor would I say something particularly amazing. It's I right. Jamaica is still better, right? This is their crispy, right? Yeah, it's it's generic. There's something about Jamaica's that I don't know what's in the seasoning, bro. Jamaica got some real solid seasoning in theirs, but here, it's generic. It's generic. Can't so bad. I can't be mad with this. This is what I'm trying to say. Why do I say that? That's because it's not bursting with flavor like how Jamaica's is. Jamaica got crazy flavor. This? I would say this is definitely better than the United States of America. Oh, I see. I didn't get the original. So that's probably why. I gotta try the original instead of crispy, but crispy is fine. But yo, buffalo sauce in the packet though? That's dead it. Let me point out that ketchup does make a difference. Here in Costa Rica, it is on the sweet side. So I do like me some sweet ketchup. I haven't even tried this yet. Fluffy, crispy, not salty. It's a decent bread. It's doughy compared to like the steaks that will like straight up kill you. This is fine. You ain't gonna die eating this, honestly. Okay, so that barbecue chicken burger ain't no slouch, bro. Looks solid. Chicken looking beefy. Ah. Ooh, cheddar cheese. The cheese makes out of all this taste so much better. 1,000%. Oh, it's bacon and ham. Oh. Dang, look at that, son. Right. You should have shot that, right? Okay. Okay. They're going in. He's open. That's all you. We got a lone island over there too. <laughs> oh, and that's um, Isla Olita. Olita? Yeah. Down there, you see the island? Yeah. Yeah. So um, you rent a boat and they take you there and you can camp. Um, Sounds like something I want to do. Yeah, I've been, been here. Always got to point this out in the culture, bro. Catch them and mayonnaise and some. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh snap. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. The rice and pizza. All right, that's what I'm talking about. The habit. The rice and peas. That's how I like it. Can you see the smoke coming out of this? Man, here we go. But I know this is very Costa Rican. The pasta and everything else with the veg and all of this. This is, this is what dreams are made of, man. I like it so far. Oh yes, side of potato, um, French fries too, mm. and this drink. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this building's a hundred years old. So if that's 100 years old, you said you said this one was um was the best furniture store? Yeah, the first biggest furniture store, Lemo. Lemo is the first biggest furniture store. But they were they still in operation or Yeah, but you know, a little bit. Not, not much. Not so much because of the competition. Yeah. All right. So they got the competition. Got you. And this building can be a company building. So it's a company building. Welcome to Puerto Limon. Yes, All right, brother. Yeah. This so, was the company building. All of this was all a company building. Yeah. All right. Big commissariat. Oh, so I see with coffee and all that stuff. Yeah. Okay. So it's still popular, I guess. Mm. Or not so much. Yeah. See there, that's Park and Vargas. Ah. Uh. To it now. And this is uh, Costa Rica Bank. Okay. That's National Bank and it's Costa Rica National Bank. Costa Rica Bank. Yeah. All right. What's the difference between the two? Uh, what could be? 
I don't know much about that, but I know it's, you know, I got a different. You know. Got you. And we walk all the way. So is this the park that we was at yesterday, or this is a different no, park? No, we were at that side. Ah. Yeah. So now what side are we on right now? We are the, we, we just uh, 100 yards from the sea. 100 yards from the sea? Yeah. All right. So that's the first, uh, first avenue, and this is the second avenue. First avenue, and this is second. second oh, yeah, so you can walk. Oh, the strip still continues. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, you get that tomorrow, uh, Monday. You get this yeah, 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 yeah. When you get it in the day and you get it in the night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get a little of the night and then yeah. in the daytime. You can you can tell me all over again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's not a problem. Boss, what's up? Hey, bro, yeah. All right. I like that. I didn't even know there's so much places to hang out because I thought once the sun goes down, everybody in Lamont go home. Yeah. <laughs> but there's people still out here, you know? Ah, oh, yes. I haven't tried the Imperium yet. No. No, I haven't tried it yet. So okay. I know normally I'll try a local bear once. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I haven't tried it yet. So I think that's on my bucket list to try it once. Okay. I, even though I don't drink bear at all. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll try it. Well, I know um, for Costa Rica. This is one whole block. You know. So, yeah, it's one large block. I know this. So, can you tell me about um, what is this? Is this a hotel? Um, this, is, this is um, municipal. Oh. First time building. Building. Okay. This, is, this was the municipal and the government, the governor. Okay. Municipal and the, so you got the mayor and the governor here first. Governor building at them time. Okay. It's the governor's building. Yes, not anymore. Not anymore. So what is it now? Because we don't use uh, we only use mayor now. We don't use governor anymore. Oh, you use mayors. mayors only yeah, mayor controls everything. So mayor is the new governor. <laughs> He's controlling everything now. The the mayor is the new governor. I got you. That makes okay. That, I can understand that. Wonderful, was like this. You see how it's full of light? Uh huh. It's, it's so this was like, you know, whatever. But he dies them teeth, them all, whatever, you know. Mm. That's good to know. Could wash my face off of it. <laughs> <laughs> and I was looking for it. Okay. And this is the sea. Yeah, uh, the oh, there's a sign that's, I can't read it. Something, yeah. oh, okay. Uh, El Tor de Limón es, uh, uh, es, su gente. es su gente. Yeah. What does that mean? The best of Limón is the people. Uh, oh, su gente, su gente, si, 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 si. I was like, it's, it, uh, the E is missing, that's what it is. Yeah, the best of Limón is its people. The best of Limón is its people. Yeah. I'll definitely get this again in the daytime. Of course, of course. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Then if I would have knew that there was so much more to see, I would have brought my drone again. Yeah. There we go. So, if you follow, so, so best of Lamon, it's its people. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. So now if you follow, if you follow the, the this one, the C1. Uh-huh. You go on the way around for like, like a snake. Uh huh. So when you get around that side, you book up on where we was last. Where we were last yeah. night. So question: Do people land. use the sea in the daytime besides fishing, or do they swim in it, or what? No, no, not here because there's a lot of reef. A lot of reef and rock and all of that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So not see the boats. I'm still fishing. Yeah, I see. They're still fishing. That must be some good fish. <laughs> It'll be good fish. Yeah. Yeah, guys, if you see that light, that's them. Menu, good food. You saw the Highland? Which one? The book, the tourism book. Okay, so Isla, there's an island. Isla Obita. Isla Obita. Okay. okay. So that's Costa Rica's island. Costa Rica island. That's Limon Island. Limon Island. I didn't even know. You know, I can see the shadow. Okay. I, I can see the shadow of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, how good is that island? Is it an expensive island or, or what? No, 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 nothing here. Nothing? No, no, just to go and chill out with you know, by yourself. You know, you oh, yourself. so how would I get there? You have nothing there. 
I, I would have to swim there myself. Boat, boat ride. There's boat rides that go over there? Yeah, boat ride and that's um, 5, 6, 11. So $11 round trip round to trip. go and come back? Yeah, go and come back. Go and come back. Okay, so go and come back is $11 mm -hmm. just to go visit. Just to go and visit and because it's not. Day, I'm pretty day. sure there's animals there too, right? Mm, iguanas, birds. Yeah. Uh, I would do it one next time. Because yeah. I, don't, I don't think I have shorts. And, I have shorts, but I don't, I'm not ready for... I need my drone to do that. <laughs> okay. I'll come back with my equipment and then do it again. Right. Okay. So Isla Obita. Isla Obita. Okay. Isla Obita. Then you have Isla de Pajaros. Oh, Bird Island. Yeah, Bird Island is um it is uh what both twelve kilometers from here. Ah, oh, okay. No, there's there's a lot of things that you can do in Limon. I didn't know that. Yeah. Then we have beach in the south and we have beach. Yeah, I heard in about. The, in the north. Yeah. Um. Yeah. What is it? Playa Blanc Bonita. Playa, Playa bon Bonita. Yeah. Yeah, I heard about that one. Yeah. Okay. Really okay. It's really bonita. <laughs> it is. It's really bonita. Really bonita. Yeah. I guess we'll, we'll have to save that for next time then. No. Yeah. When you come back, no. When you can, when you come back, we're going to the north. Okay, that works, that works, that works. Can do that. That sounds cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. Wow, this is a treat. I didn't even know that. So we came, so we went somewhere. Okay. Right to the north. How you doing? Buenas noches. Ooh, I like how they said together. <laughs> Buenas noches. I don't know. This is, um, maybe because it's the second time that I'm here exploring but i know for me being a single man i see a whole lot of attractive women here oh, yeah. i just have to say it <laughs> you know <laughs> I, think, well, no. I think i think maybe that's why i like limon so much <laughs> okay. oh i think i passed through this i'm not sure if it was this hotel I think I did pass it. And I did see like there's a lot of people here. I think that hotel was booked too. For obvious reasons. Hey, this is one of the health business building. It's a health building. Okay, I see it. Ministry of Health. Yeah, All right. That's the here is where the most of kids burn for the last year. Oh. Old building. Old building. Okay. And that's where the most of the kids in the 60s and 50s they're burned. Oh, geez. You was born here? Yeah. You was born in that one, I know. <laughs> no, I born in Kawita. Kawita. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, we only went past tomorrow. Gotcha. But that's in the in your list um it wasn't in my list you don't check it no no that you know places to know on your, on your map it's in your, you don't see it on the map i don't but you don't try you don't travel with map nope i go and just find out <laughs> oh, okay. i just go and explore i don't you know what i'm saying it's like i i rather the locals tell me about it yeah okay. then you know you know what i'm saying okay, okay. so that way you know it's um if there's an itinerary, if I miss it, I'm not disappointed. You know, okay. it just it goes with the flow. Then, uh, oh. so 60 odd years ago, 70 years ago, this was the um, white people's club. White people's club. Got you. I see sushi. Only for them, huh? Only for them. Uh-huh. Like all people's class in America, that was like that here. Oh, okay. The sushi prices look okay. Park Hotel, I did see yeah. that. Yeah, it's not so bad. Court, court house. One of the courthouses. Justice House. <laughs> Justice House. Drink, love, smile, laugh. This is a fancy restaurant, I'm guessing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Love, smile, and laugh. Yep. <laughs> All the things. Okay, I'm this area of Limon is, not, is pretty small, but it's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. That's a Walmart. 
Walmart family, más por menos. Oh, this is Walmart? Yeah, that's the same oh. family. Más wow. Más por menos. Max Cross Menos. That's funny. Yeah, that, that Walmart would do something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Walmart would say, name it like that. I got to check that out. To see if they have, um, yeah, I want to go there. Maybe, I'm not sure. You let me know what time. Hold on, hold on. What's this? You didn't tell me about this one. This is a culture building. Oh, the theater. The theater, and you know. All right. Okay. And this was another one where the kids found, a lot of kids found. Oh, another infirmary. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, and the, the fried chicken, yep. Well, oh, yeah, I love fried chicken. There goes the wild dog, then. <laughs> Make me want to take the dog. They look better than the Jamaican wild dog. So you guide yourself with that? You guide yourself with the church. When you find that, you go straight up and you go to the club. Right. Okay, so now we got the um, Chinese Association building. Okay. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen a lot of Chinese Costa Ricans too. That was a they shock. They're the association. Oh. Maybe the, you could tell me what that says. I can't read. <laughs> I can read some Japanese, but I can't read Chinese. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is the building. Ah, oh, so it's a Chinese building. Got gotcha. you. Okay. And we're back at... Is this the one of the most popular clubs here? Because I always see people out here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, this one. And the other corner from the block, from the club, the following corner. Yeah. Oh, well, we passed there last night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're to the, to the park. It like yeah, it was very, it was yeah. busy. So those are the two most popular park, um, clubs. And Disco. Oh, yeah. uh, all right. Because I'm like, I always, even in the daytime, there's people right, out here. Right. Daytime and nighttime, there's yeah. people at the club, right by the KFC. Every other corner had a bar. Oh, every so corner had a bar. Every little bit, so everybody's here now. Right? Oh, it makes sense now. Here was a bar. Uh, oh, so there's another bar down there, you're saying? Was, you know, so every other corner had Every a corner bar. had a bar. The corner here had a bar. Okay, down there had a bar, down there had a bar, down there had a bar. Every corner had a bar. Every corner had a bar. That makes sense. Same yeah, that was a good little history tour. Right. I like that. Appreciate it, brother. But you told me more about the Jamaicans. I even know though that they live near the trade, yeah. the railroads. Yeah, yeah. We will be back. We will be back. Mhm. Mm we'll be back. We'll be back. We'll be. My shoes are soaked. Everything on me is soaked. I am soaked. McDonald's Costa Rica. Let me tell you guys something, man. I like it. The patty tastes like it tastes like McDonald's in the States. Bun definitely tastes like it's from somewhere else. So this is Costa Rican bun. And the universal Jamaica, not to, why am I on Jamaica mode? And the universal McDonald's patty, right? It makes it taste like McDonald's, legit. Now, it can't be, whoops, hot. It can't be Latin America if it ain't McDonald's and chicken, all right? McDonald's chicken, all right? That's how you know it's Latin America. Solid fried chicken. Solid fried chicken. Here's the fries, all right? This is indeed McDonald's fries. Tastes just like McDonald's, all right? Just giving you a heads up, I would buy. All right? Fried chicken, burgers, I would buy. Okay, y'all. Uh, this is McDonald's using their own ingredients, as they say. We got our apple pie. And there was a uh, pineapple pie on the menu. Didn't think this is it. I think the lady said something. 
I don't know what she said, but we got a pineapple pie. Mmm. That's crispy. I like it. And yeah, of course, you got your Sochik McMuffins and Ham McMuffin. Hash brown. You know what I'm saying? Apple juice. Let's go McDonald's Costa Rica. I see you. The apple pie is quite solid, though. I'm gonna eat this last one. It's quite solid. You know what I'm saying? I mean, this is quite airy, crispy, but it ain't so bad. That's the food delivery drivers here. But early in the morning, man, me being the only one here, food hot off the presses, man. <clears throat> solid, man. This is some real sweet pineapple pie, man. With a nice goozing feeling. It reminds me more of not McDonald's apple pies, but more like what you call it? I think Popeyes apple pies. Pineapple filled pies. Yeah, it's the first time I had something like this. Pineapple pie, solid. I like it. Manzana. Pasta de manzana. Apple pie. Mm. There's definitely a lot more apple chunks in this McDonald's apple pie. I remember having an apple pie where it's like the apples are kind of smooth when it's like caramelized. But once this is caramelized, oh man, strong cinnamon flavor, crunchy apples, and a crunchy crust as well. It really tastes like they just cut the apple. I kid you not. It's the freshest apple pie I've had. Mm. Let's go. Hash brown. I like this hash brown because it doesn't taste oily like the United States. It's good. Mm. We in there. Yeah, we with it. Damn. All right, man. Let's. A little thirsty or after all that savory and sweet sweet and savory see what our juice tastes like I'm not a coffee person but i do like orange juice that's what i'm talking about refreshing orange juice man as if i've always needed it our first sausage with muffin of course we'll eat it plain i always have ketchup to eat it with it oh man the english muffin is nice and soft with uh the egg tastes similar you know how it is in the states i mean Hopefully this is Costa Rica's own sausage because it tastes really similar to like New York. Not New York, it tastes similar to like in the States. This is really soft bread. Not flaky, not crispy, soft. Nice bite. I like the cheese, man. The cheese is awesome. With the ketchup, it has a nice overall taste with the ketchup, man. Gives it a nice, sweet, traditional taste. You know what I'm saying? I have an egg sandwich with ketchup. I approve. The regular ham McMuffin, I just went ahead and just <laughs> put the ketchup on it. I already know I'm going to like it anyway. I will just point this out there. English muffin. I believe it might be corn based though. But yo, look. Dang, that's how you know it's like some fresh bread, bro. You see all of that on your fingertips. The fresh bread. Mmm. That's legit. I like me some soft bread, man. I don't know what the best this one's going to taste like. Supermarket. Mm -hmm. Come on, I'll buy this stuff. You go to the supermarket and you get everything. I get it. <laughs> From a pair of shoes, a pair of shoes straight up to a onion, meat, whatever. Uh huh. The other side. Okay. All right. Hold on. I see. Oh, spices and all that herbs. I like that. Herbs and spices. Spice this side, spice that side. Mm-hmm. Our spice is big. I've seen it. I've seen it all, all, all over the world. And I see the hard dough bread or black man no, bread. that one is uh, coconut bread. It's the cocoa bread? Coconut. Oh. Yeah, cocoa bread. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, so there goes the Aki. I was just talking to someone earlier about Aki. La Casa del Aki. What I notice about cats here. What's up? The grater. Oh, I see the grater. That's where my mom will get the nutmeg and start 
scraping it to make her cornmeal. She takes a smaller one. Yeah. She takes this one. Okay. And yeah. then I use the side to grate the nutmeg and the um, other spice. One thing I noticed about all the cats here, they're not afraid of people or they're too hot to be running around. Alright. When they finish it, right? Oh, I smell that fume. <laughs> fresco shop? What's fresco? Fresh? So, brand new? Oh, anything. Ah, oh, got you. Fresco. You got one. So, what happened to them? So, so, so what happened? Uh, <laughs> what we could say now. Oh, well, it has something to do with 2020? One thing pushing out the other. Ah, gotcha. Yes. Competition. Competition. The best way to put it. Okay. We got swim trunks too. They come from the town to post Okay. No, no, you're not busy. All right. Take care. That's it. Not everybody likes it. And I understand. So, so I, I put it in the side. I get that a lot too. So sometimes I often have to ask. Yeah. You know, you never so know. Yep. Oh, this door is finally open. Yeah. So what's usually inside there? That's uh same business. Yeah. This one. Yeah. This same business going away. Ah, gotcha. And then some way and then the fox. Okay. Now I finally get to see a lot of these things open that I've never okay. seen. Emblematic building. Building to that one. Italians is who build Yeah? What was Italians doing over here? Oh? Yeah, why? Why were they here? Uh, okay, it was Italian was a Hey, traveling, traveling. I finally got to see it open. They got a lot of TVs and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Cafe Le Monde. This building, this one comes from Germany. The Germans yeah. built German this building. Way. Finally got to see this open too. Oh, okay. So it's an artist alley, artistico. Yes. The owner lend the, 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 the space, you know, lend them the space. Okay. Just to gotcha. do, do a little thing, you know. Gotcha. There's a difference on the night. A very big difference. <laughs> I got to see what's open. This yeah. store kind of is similar to Gallo. I can see that. They're fighting for food. That's the baby. Baby. Yeah, it's a baby. He said, I want some food. El Gallo Mas Gallo. So they're all the same shop. Yeah, Gallo. Yeah. Gallo, Boyo. <laughs> One is but I'm, I'm wondering why they call it chicken, though. I'm like, or rooster. Okay. It makes no sense. Do you know why? No, no. no. I'm wondering what does roosters have to do with, you no, know, just, shopping? Just a name, just a name. A, a name that everybody seems to, like, want to take. I wonder what happened here. The whole heap of Cersei. Oh, this is all Cersei? Yeah. I might, I might take some. Huh? Alright, yeah, I'm going to take some. Might take some and drink it tonight. Dang, what happened here? Right, so I'm at a Chinese food restaurant that I'm trying for the first time here in Costa Rica and I'm trying the soup. I wasn't expecting a, such a big bowl of soup. I was actually expecting something a little bit on the smaller side because <laughs> I ordered two things. But nevertheless, this is actually good. It, it is a good tea. I mean, 
I call, you call it fresh tea, but it's a good fresh seafood soup with uh, so much flavor and so much vegetables up in it. You got your cauliflower. I think this is Toyota. And you got the shrimps up in there too and broccoli. And this is this is pretty solid. I can't lie. Oh, no, no. This, this All of this must be broccoli. Broccoli and... Uh, is it cabbage or Chinese vegetable? One or the other. Would like to see me do more of these type of content, like the viral video that I did. Consider reaching out and donating to my Cash App and PayPal. That is going to be in the description because each dollar would help projects like this for me to do the research, link up with people, and give you guys what you want. But you know, I'm grateful nevertheless. You guys have been a loyal fan base, and it's great connecting with each and y'all in the comments. Once again, y'all, thanks so much for watching. Be sure to drop a comment at the bottom of this video what you think about this filler episode. Trust me, I read each and every one of your comments as the last viral video, I will took the time out to comment to each and every one of y'all. You guys have been an awesome fan base. I truly do enjoy the suggestions that I'm getting from y'all. And we'll see what holds in the future. We'll see, we'll see. Like this video, share this video if you can. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Nate, in your state.